we have always been confusing and convincing ourselves as to what the right thing is on how to formulate feed for our pigs as farmers. In today's lecture, we will clear all doubts and help make every farmer become more successful and profitable as well as economical in their farm. Do not pay attention to all those feed formulation experts. It's a lie. This is what you need to do if you want your pigs to grow very fast. I will always use my farm as a point of reference. Hi, Pigovacians, you are welcome to the lecture. If you want your pigs to grow very fast, you are supposed to feed them correctly right from the piglet stage to the time of weaning them. If you have ever taken note, piglets are able to double their size and weight after the first week of farrowing. That is how they are naturally made, especially if they get great and quality breast milk from the sow. If you miss feeding them right in their early weeks, which are usually when they are 2 weeks old up to 5 weeks old, then forget about feeding them better in the growing stage. Nothing significant at all will change. Do not allow piglets and winners to feed on moths and fiber products like the rice bran and leaves because they can't digest to absorb them. Instead, get them a feed that consists of three main ingredients, maize or corn, soya bean or fish milk, or any protein source available. And any of these oil producing crops, the sunflower is there and other nuts are also available. The most important thing is to make the protein part between 18 to 26 percent of the total feed, with corn serving as the energy source being the major part, making about 70 to 75 percent of the total feed as well. You can also get premix from the market, which costs less to add more amino acids to the feed of the piglet with the most common one being the lysine. No one formula fits all the time, so you will need to keep changing the composition, but keep the protein part constant. Better growth will also depend on other factors such as hygienic conditions of the pen, ability to get enough breast milk from the south, suitable temperature, and the availability of clean water. No matter how healthy your piglets appear, Never disregard giving iron to them within the first three to seven days of farrowing. It will be difficult to correct any slow or improper growth after your pigs have passed that piglets and the winner stage. No amount of feed can save them. It is also recommended that you get the piglet milk powder as they start to feed to complement the breast milk from the mother, especially if the sow is not producing enough milk. But this is optional. Doing all this in the initial phase can save you from wasting too many resources in an attempt to make your pigs grow faster as a way to correct mistakes you initially made. Also, deworm your piglets after they are weaned because they could have taken some eggs of worms from the floor during feeding. On your farm, you should be able to know which piglets will grow to become bigger and better and then larger from those that will not from how you feed them. So feed your piglets right from the beginning and see the results. Don't go and be paying for feed formulation formula. It's not going to work. Just do the writing initially and then see how your pigs will perform better on the farm.